Let's see, look at an obscure point. I know there'll be a quiz I'll ask you about this. You can answer at the end. So imagine you're given 2x squared minus 2x equals 0. First, let's just see what happens when we divide the 2 away. Does that have some kind of impact? If you graph the current left-hand side, because it's got a 2 constant, it's going to look like this. I've graphed it before, so I know. It's really peaked down here. Uh, this is 1, and this is 0. Okay, so then you divide the 2 away to see what happens. That's allowed. So you can do 2x squared divided by 2 minus 2x divided by 2 equals 0 divided by 2. So you simplify. These cancel. So you have x squared minus x equals 0. Okay, so if you graph this new left-hand side, the only difference is that because the 2 is missing, it becomes flatter. And I know this because I've graphed them before like that. So it's less peaked here. So this is like the new left-hand side left-hand side graph by itself, and this graph here that's more peaked is the original left-hand side but graphed by itself. So the point is that when you divide by 2, which is, not a, which is a constant not equal to 0, you don't lose a solution. Both of these still have x equals 0 and x equals 1 as a solution to making the left-hand side equal to 0. Something different happens when you divide by a variable, though, and that's the danger. So if you do x squared minus x equals 0, so after you divide by the 2, for example, and you then divide by x, you get a different result. Check it out. This becomes just x minus 1 equals 0. Now look, graph this, and it's just x equals 1. That's it. The x equals 0 solution that's present here is gone in this one, because x minus 1 here is a line. So you can divide by non-zero constants. It changes the shape by flattening it, for example, stretching it depends. But the important pieces, like the roots here, do not change. If you divide by a variable, then you're dividing away and you're changing the shape, then you are losing a solution right here. Here's a quiz you can answer on my community tab. If I gave you x cubed minus x squared, and this is set equal to 0, and then you look at this and you say, oh, I can just divide x squared away because it's common. So if I do this, what will be the impact? What does the original left-hand side look like if you graph it? And if you divide by x squared, what is the what? The new left-hand side look like. And what happens during that division process, what disappears, for example. Kind of important to understand. All right, that's it. Thank you.